Hey folks, Vic here with your weekly trade video for Friday, September the 6th, 2024. One of the most important things to learn with Forex trading is how to enter a trade. So, you know, like what exactly is the reasoning behind why or where, or very importantly, how you're going to enter. Okay. To answer this, uh, Darko has two options, option one and option two. And in this video, he'll explain the differences and how to use them. You know, this is the kind of stuff that separates winners from losers. It's called having a trading plan, which most traders don't. And if you need help with this, Darko gives these trading options for entry to our members in his pre-market analysis video, his PMA video, with a full explanation of why he's using which option. And by the way, Darko has taken over the short-term trading service, and he now has PMA videos for our short-term members as well, showing this kind of stuff. So hope you liked the video. If so, if you could be so kind as to hit the like button, that would be just awesome. Alrighty, here is Darko. When do I take option number one? Option number one here, option number two here. Option number one is when the, the trend is clean and clear. You have a clean uptrend or a clean downtrend. Okay, and then price is pulling back into resistance, natural stop that you're okay with, take it. Same goes for the uptrend, okay? And this is on a higher time frame and you obviously go two time frames below. Clean and clear trend, which price, not, you know, seldom does. But, are, you know, lately we have several pairs that is trending. So yeah, clean trend, option number one, no doubt. There, there is no uncertainty, there is no white stop loss. Everything looks perfect and juicy. Take it. Option number two is when there is no clear trend. Okay. No clear trend. Clear trend. Okay. Two. Uh, uncertainty. Whatever that uncertainty might be. Okay, could be red flag news, could be like, oh, I'm not sure, you know, I'm just, uh, nah, you know, it needs to be something legit, like something that you can point on. It's not like my gut feel tells me or my intuition, that's not, <laughs> okay? It needs to be something like you tell me something that you can point out, uh, you know, you have a reason, not referring to gut feel or intuition, okay? Uncertainty, okay? Or... For whatever reason, you want an extra confirmation. Extra confirmation. For if the stop loss is too wide, like the stop is like 500 pips or 300 pips or maybe 200 pips, which, which is might be too much for you. So now you, you need to wait for that lower time frame entry Option number two, you know, if there was a 300 pip stop loss on option number one, on option number two, you will probably have like 100 pip stop loss. That's a huge difference. Maybe even less. Okay? Most of the time, it, it, less. So, that, so those are the reasons. So I had to think properly. You know, I'm, obviously, I'm writing things down, scripting this so I don't miss any you know, crucial information. So those are the the reasons when I take option number one or two. And there might be things that I'm like missing or for, forget about it. These are like top of mind that just came up clearly without any effort when I take option number one and two. Okay. We have a, I think we have a, was it on a, there was a pair. Mm. No, it was. I just give me one sec, guys. It's always impossible to find any, anything in hindsight. So uh, obviously, this is not hindsight just yet. Uh, Aussie Kiwi. So this was a position trade option number one. Okay. So if something happens that you know maybe we hit in like an opposing level or. Maybe when by the time price goes up, we are very clear to an Aussie Kiwi news. Or maybe you get, you know, start seeing things that price didn't show you by when price goes up. 
Then we change that from option number one to option number two. Or let's just assume that this, this stop loss is just too wide for you. Then you need to wait for a pattern at this level. You already have the pattern because price is, you know, breaching and closing deep enough to use as a natural stop. We are convincingly reestablished background space. You already have the pattern. Okay, so if you don't afford this, then you just go to the option number two. So I hope that was useful and that you can see that not all setups are created equal. Having a profound understanding of the bigger picture and of course Darko's advanced market flow which shows trend are really critical in helping you know the options for entering a trade. And like I said, uh, Darko covers all of these things in his pre-market analysis videos for our members. Uh, and don't forget that Darko now has taken over the short-term trading service and this kind of stuff is provided for our short-term members now as well. Thank you as always for taking the time to listen to our videos. We really do appreciate it. Uh, yeah, so wishing you all a great weekend and we'll be back next week with another weekly trade video. Take care.